So I'm back with another video today, and today's video will be about the... Um, I'm just gonna show off some more raids with the Gorilla Gatling Gun. I just like using this strategy for now. I think it's really good at Lancer, a couple Gatling Guns, and then Gorilla. And so basically, the Gatling Guns definitely have to protect the Gorillas, and the Lancers are just being the meat shield and doing the damage. And so let's see if this is gonna work out or not. So, I'm just going to uh, have an armor blessing, and let's just go into it and see. Let's try to fight a little bit harder base this time, let's see. Okay, level 74. Mm, I mean, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I can beat that one. So, let's, let's go for a little bit harder. Hmm. This person. So... I think I can actually do this. Okay. Um, what I'm going to worry about is these towers right here, they all have gates in them. But there's no gates on this side. If you see where I'm pointing, like with the, the cursor. So that means the troops can't go in that way. That means that they have to go around this way or this way. And so they have a lot of troops over here that I need to take out too. So I'm going to put all my lancers down here to take out all these. And then I'm going to put up my gorilla over here. So they'll, they'll go through the gates over here, and then if anything, I will rally them back if, if need be. And I'll put my Gatling guns over here, so the, to protect the, the Lancers, kind of. I mean, they don't need that much protection, but still. Oh no, they got through. Oh, he does have a gate over there. Oh, uh, gotta rally everyone back together. Run, gorillas, run! Uh, poop. Gatling guns, protect them. That's gonna be bad. Okay, good. I think they actually got protected, so it's all good. Oh, that, that one girl is over there. I didn't even notice him. He's this lone guy over here is doing all the work, so it's all good. Oh my gosh. Okay, all those um. Let me rally everyone back over together over here, because the Gatling gun is not uh, taking out those troops, and that's that's a big problem right now. Actually, I haven't lost any troops, and this is, he has, his walls are almost, uh, all of them are level 7, so it's fairly decent. So let's get in there. And, oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. That's okay. It's all good. I don't think I actually lost any troops on this one. It's pretty good. Okay, so, you know, they're basically doing everything. Blow up the walls for no reason. Okay, so there's a lot of food and gold. Okay, we have about a minute left, so let's see if we can try to get all the food. Okay, the Gatling guns are doing work over here, so it should be fine. The gorillas are down over here blowing up the town center. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying these raids and stuff like that. I'm, I know I'm not the best player, you know, on YouTube or anything, or just in general, but I'm working on my, you know, working on my strategies too. Cause I know you guys. I, I'm glad that you guys, you know, watch my videos and everything. Cause, you know, I know I'm definitely not the best. And so, I hope you guys are just joining. You know, cause everyone makes flubs. I make flubs too. You know, you guys see my my videos when I flub up really bad. I I post it anyways, cause you know, no one's perfect. And you you don't want to make the same mistakes that everyone else has made. So, okay, I think I'm gonna four star this base. If those, uh, let's see, the girls can take out those things over there because they only do 20x damage against buildings and walls so you know against normal like resource buildings they don't really do that much damage so let's see yeah, might as well just look at them there's two of them over here and I have a infantry unit helping them out so let's see 98% and that should be the last thing so might as well rally them even though they're not gonna get there in time Where are they oh nope I was right Anyways, 14 medals, nice. Okay, I'm gonna try, like, I don't know. I was watching another uh, Dominations person and on YouTube, and he was talking about how you should just, you should just medal, you know, like, um, don't drop medals, just keep, you know, keep rising up the ranks. And so, I think that might be a good idea because there's better league bonuses and stuff. Um, I'm still gonna fight the same opponents. And I just, I just needed to get better, I guess. And so, let's see. I don't think I lost any troops. Perfect. Okay, so let's do another raid then. 
Uh, let's see. Let me get another armor blessing. Yep. Did I get a diamond from that one? Please tell me I did. Nope. Okay. That's fine. Okay, let's keep going. Do, 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 do. I don't know, I'm still enjoying this game. I know some people are quite tired of this game because all the cheaters and stuff like that, but I, personally, I'm still enjoying this game because I'm not not maxed out yet or anything like that. So, Whew. This is level... It's almost a nearly max base. I, I, I don't think... Uh, yeah, I'm not going to be able to beat him or her. I don't know if they're cheating or not. Who knows? Okay, uh, I mean, these are decent bases. They just have decent loot. But, um, yeah, these are not... Yeah, there's no way it's going to beat that max base almost. I think it's a maxed out base. Definitely need to get... I need to upgrade my troops and so much food, you know, that it takes to get it all. So, let's see. Let's take on this one. It's a low 72 British, um, British gunpowder age. Hmm... Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start from this side over here. Uh, this this side because there's a let's see, there's a castle right here and a tower and mortars. So I'm gonna put my gorillas in now. Hopefully they don't get attacked by the stable. That's about to like they're about to put out their troops. So gotta watch out for that. Okay, what I'm going to do is going to use a protect and protect them all so that they'll take only half damage for 40 seconds, which is going to be really helpful. Oh no. He did a lot of damage, but... Okay, good. Gatling got protected him. Nice. Oh man, the Gat... Oh man, those, those gorillas can take it out by themselves, so... That's all good right there, so... Let's see, they're getting inside. I definitely need to... Okay, yeah, good. They got inside. Uh, I think that gorilla's gonna die. No! Come on, stay alive. Stay alive. Don't get attacked. Oh my gosh. I don't, I, my Gatling guns are not close enough to protect them. Okay, I lost one gorilla. It's not bad, actually, though. Okay. Oh, this is free now. So, I lost, let's see, two Lancers and one gorilla. It's not bad. I mean, this is an easy base. Uh, an easier base, so... I mean, it's decent loot too. So, um, I just tell you what you guys, what you guys, I think you guys should do. Always, if you're gonna use gorillas, look for where there's not too many defensive building or you know, like stables and garrisons. Kind of wait till they kind of, um, if they start spawning troops, definitely send your Gatling guns in or rally them together so they don't get destroyed. Because they have a decent amount of health, but still, like, there's still there's a limit to how much health they have still, you know. So. So let's see. Okay, cool. I got a diamond. Nice. So I can actually get 3%. I'm going to get a weapon blessing in the next raid. Anyways, let me just kind of zoom up so you guys can see. You can see the uh, gorillas. Because I know you guys have already seen the other ones, so might as well. See this? Just timer. Yeah, it doesn't see. It, it really does that much damage against, like, resource buildings. But, like, against defensive buildings, it's, it's really strong. Really strong. I really like how it by bypasses gates, so, you know, many people always, everyone has to have a gate for something so then they can let out the troops, but now it kind of makes you, like, think about it, if you really should have a gate or not, like, there. Okay. Let's see. I don't know, I'm look definitely looking forward to the Industrial Age. I hope you guys are looking forward to the Industrial Age also. Um, you know, I'll definitely make a video as soon as it comes out, so... Definitely look forward to that. Uh, what's left? Ah, uh, that one house. Okay, come on, guys. Oh, good. The gorilla. He can go to the gate, so I don't... Oh, and the Gatling gun can shoot over it, so... It's all good. <laughs> See, it, can, it can't even destroy a house by itself. Like, it takes multiple hits to destroy a house, so... That says something. So, let's see. We lost two Lancers and one gorilla. Um, I'm probably just going to use some crowns so I can show at least one more raid off and then we're going to end off the video here. Now after that, this next raid, so. 
Uh, that's three. And let's see, troops. Lancer, Lancer, two, so that's four. It's all good. I mean, it's just a couple crowns here and there. Um, let's see. I need to build up another protect. I don't have any more protects now. Those are really helpful, actually. I need to. I think I should just make four of those, or maybe like one sabotage and like you know, four, uh, three of those instead. So let's get some blessings. Uh, armor blessing and uh, weapon blessing. Okay, so this is gonna be the last raid of the video. So let's see what we got. Let's see who we're gonna get this time. Okay, level 56. It's too easy. I kind of want to get someone around like level like 90 to like 100. Or someone that enlightenment age. Because I know like anyone that medieval and gunpowder, it's usually it's pretty easy. This is level 71, but he's like... Everything's really spread out. I mean, this should be really easy. So I'm going to try to find... I don't want to go through too many. So hopefully you guys don't like, you know, get really... Um, tired of watching me try to find a decent opponent. Anyways, I'll just kind of talk in the meantime. Um, you know, they posted a Q&A and stuff like that, and they posted some new videos of the oil bo uh, boom troops. So there's definitely a lot of new content that's going to come out soon. There's still a lot of bugs, though. I saw a video of a guy, uh, and he, I don't think he cheats at all, but he got, like, he got the industrial troops somehow, and, like, so he was showing off the industrial troops, like tanks and stuff like that. And I was like, man, that's really cool. I wish I had that, you know, just to show off. But, you know, I can't do that, so. Okay. So, hmm. This is going to be interesting. Um, let's see. Okay. So, I definitely need to worry about this stuff first right here, like the catapult, the ballista tower. So if I send out the gorillas, it should be fine because they shouldn't get attacked until uh, troops start coming out. So that's what I'm going to hope for. I'm going to have them attack the ballista towers instead first so I can get them out of the way so I can put my lancers down. Okay, and now I'm going to have to send out the gatling guns because I don't want them to get um, attacked. Okay, definitely they got saved. Okay, nice. Okay, the galleon guns are doing work uh, protecting my troops because uh, definitely need it. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to rally them back together right now to kind of save the garrisons and also take out the troops as they come up. Okay, nice. I don't know why my Lancers went over there, like, the AI is pretty screwed up right now. It doesn't make any sense in my opinion. Oh, please take out that garrison before- No! That was so close. Yep, sorry, Gorilla, you're- you're, you're gonna be gone. But you did- did a lot of- you did a lot of work before you as the cud went out in glory. Okay, so where's my other Gorillas? Okay, they're right here. Nice, okay. I have two more. Oh, the gorilla's still alive? Wow. And that one's still living. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoa. Look, you see how much health he has? Like a sliver of health left. Okay, I lost one Lancer and one gorilla so far. I think I took out all the defensive buildings already. Yep. And I'm gonna get some oil. Nice. Okay, so... Let's see, they, they take out the town center right now. You know, basic stuff. After you finish, you kind of just watch them, basically, and then just kind of rally whenever they need to kind of get to the spot that they need to. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys really enjoy these raids. Um, I'm enjoying making these videos for you guys. I'm trying to make a lot of videos in advance because I get kind of busy, so, so then I can just have them on a scheduled upload for you guys so you can have videos daily. Uh, let me know what else you guys want to see. Um, what troop combinations or what just type of videos you guys want to see. Because I'm all up for suggestions. You guys are the reason I make these videos. So I always want to li listen to your feedback. And I always try to leave comments. Uh, I always try to reply to everyone's comment. You know, at least the first one that they, they put out. And then I try to reply to all of them. So, oh no. They had an ambush trap. Oh no. Take out those troops. I don't want to lose another gorilla. This oil is expensive. Okay. Let's see. I have... 
21 seconds left for a rally. I even want to try to get this oil over here. Come on. Come on. Oh, nice. I got a diamond. Great. Anyways, guys. Yeah, definitely let me know what you guys want to see. I will definitely try to make it for you guys because I want to, you know, it's, some stuff gets kind of stale after a while, you know, because it's not, it hasn't been a new update for a little bit of time. And so, you know, definitely try to look to see if there's anything new and interesting. Okay, guys, let's see. Yep, lost one and one. It's not bad. I think this strategy is actually quite strong. I don't know if they're there. Like the the highest levels, I don't know if it's gonna work, but definitely at these yeah, like mid levels to like upper levels, it's definitely a good strategy. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed these videos, and I'll see you guys next time.